Hi, if you're watching this video, you just ordered a Fire Wallet, and let me tell you, this is the beginning of something so, so fun. Whether you want to prank the hell out of someone you know, surprise a cashier, or honestly just light something up in a cool way, this is perfect for you. So stick around while I give you a quick tutorial. First off, let's start with the basics. The Fire Wallet is supposed to be used as an everyday wallet, like you can use it to store all your cash and cards. In this page right here, there are three slots for cards and one slot behind it. This is where I personally store my credit cards and ID, and you'll also have this photo slot if you want to put a nice photo or honestly just another card. For your cash, there are two separated cash slots, which is super helpful if you want to differentiate your big bills and small bills. And now let's get to the part you guys have been waiting for, how do I start the fire? If you missed it in our listing or our videos, you do need lighter fluid to actually start the fire. Let me tell you, I know it sucks that lighter fluid does not come in your package, but it is such a flammable and dangerous good that we just can't ship it. There are so many regulations. So from the bottom of our hearts, sorry for the inconvenience, but on the bright side, it's only two to three dollars online or on Amazon. All you have to do is search up lighter fluid. Zippo and Ronsonal are really good brands. And by the way, if you wanna use charcoal fluid, it does work, but the results won't be as good. So step number one, you need to apply the lighter fluid. This shouldn't be an insane amount, just a few seconds of applying it and you should be good. And PSA, you wanna spread it evenly across the two fire patches and also make sure there's a little bit of lighter fluid close to the flint wheel. Step number two is you flick the flint wheel. And if you flick the flint wheel without applying lighter fluid, it'll just create the spark. So what the lighter fluid does is it makes the spark catch onto something flammable and then it starts the fire. It's almost like if you dropped a match on a puddle of gasoline, except it's a lot safer. The first time you do it might be scary, but I promise you it becomes really, really easy after the first few tries. Just make sure you hold it steadily. And when you're flicking it, make sure to do it fast and with a little bit of force. Also, if you flick the flint wheel and there's no spark coming out at all, there might be a defect with your wallet. Just send us a quick message on TikTok and we'll be sure to give you a full refund as well as a new wallet. And number three, when you wanna stop the fire, all you have to do is close the wallet up. Literally just fold it together and the fire will disappear. And that's all you need to know. If you ever need anything, have any questions, or think there's something wrong with your wallet, please, please, please just reach out to us. We have a great customer support team who wants to make sure you have a good experience and will offer refunds if there's something wrong with your product. I hope you guys enjoy the Fire Wallet. It is honestly such a fun product. So much, so much fun to just prank strangers or prank people you know. And this thing will get a good laugh out of almost anyone. So that's about it. Have fun with the Fire Wallet. See you guys later.